I've always been a dreamer. If I dream about something, it happens. It might sound crazy. But you might end up in a G-Wagon strapped with cameras driving around the hood. <laughs> There's always something funny going on. It's, it's Penner. Rip it, lad! The west of Sydney, my little piece of home. Look, now he's ringing the boys, saying, look, I'm on camera with Bear Bear. <laughs> Everyone notices my big head. <laughs> Good riders, bro. They all just seem to be really talented from out here. <laughs> They're from the area. They're just young kids. It's a good feeling that the young fellas look up to me. I'm just trying my best. I'm the same as them. You know, you got to pick something and go for it. Give it your all. I give love to everyone, so. You give love, you get love. That's how life works. I just love f***ing smacking people. Obviously, I've had some time off. I went hard for two years. It's good to be back doing the father things and have my people close. I feel a lot more grown up. My partner, Millie, she's been uh, helping me with my food and keeping my stuff at home on top, so it's been good. I feel like my team's been working really well and I feel good and I feel very fit. Good to be training with familiar faces. My training has been long. I just want to come in very fit for this fight and uh, hopefully get it done fast. I've spent too much time running around and sweating my ass off. I'm ready to fight five rounds, but definitely uh, going in there to take heads off. If I dink him, I sink him. Body's sore the time, so it's got a sauna and ice bath at home. I've just been doing my recovery daily, so it's good. I feel fresh, I feel alive, and uh, very excited for UFC Sydney. I went through probably the hardest time in my life just before my debut. I signed with the UFC in 2016. I bunged my knee, so I was out for a year. I did knee surgery, I lost all feeling in my arm. I had my son. He was just brand new, I couldn't hold him. So it was a lot of it was a it was a lot of relief once I got to fight. You do not know what's <laughs> gonna happen between these two heavy-handed fighters. That's something I'll never forget. West of Sydney, we're growing, we're getting better. A lot of success stories are coming from out of here and it's turning into what I've always pictured in my mind. As some would say, God's country. This gravy, I don't know what it is in it, but whatever it is, it's highly addictive. See, and that's why we're fat. <laughs> I'm just a normal bloke. I try to do my best with the community, but uh, other than just giving back, it's more about showing. I want to try and show them that the kids from where I'm from, they can be successful and do whatever they want. 
best come from the worst. It's proven. The growth in UFC worldwide is, is pretty crazy. I kind of put it down to, you know, without the fans, who would I be? I'm grateful. I feel like I go all right in front of the camera. Pretty good looking still. How good to have fights back in Sydney. <laughs> it's been a long time coming, so I'm pumped. Born and raised here, I'll probably be here for a lot longer. Me and my mum spent a lot of time in the car. We did a lot of cruising around. <laughs> uh, my mum listened to all the maddest tracks, all the old school tracks. I still think they're the best tracks, you know. Shaggy, Vanessa Amorossi, Shania Twain. Right, just bangers. All my workouts are entertaining, so oh, we should always expect something fun. <laughs> September 10, we'll see. The feeling of walking out, the buzz you get from that, you can't replace. But the difference is, my bank's a bit more full than that. So we're walking out a bit of more small. Coming off of two losses, so I definitely want to get back in the winning column. Volkov's a lot taller than a lot of the heavyweights. Very strong Russian, but nothing crazy that I haven't seen before. I'm in there to bang, I'm in there to get close and uh, get physical. I think my power will be the difference. I see me beating Volkov with a Bam Bam style knockout. My family's gonna be there. All the people that love me and support me are gonna be there. And you wanna live up to the height, you know, and make everyone proud. I am to ah. After a nice good win, a nice beautiful shoe full of drink west will go down. Beautiful.